This video does not dispense from reading the user guide how to replace the rubber washers of the BKL version 1.0 carefully. Badenko disclaims all liability for incidents resulting from any non-compliance with the rules recommended. Do you have a shuttlecock launcher from Badenko and your rubber washers are worn out after a long usage? This video shows how to replace the rubber washers. First of all, you need to have your kit available on our website badenko.com. The machine must be switched out before the following steps. To begin, you need to check that your kit includes one user guide, two rubber washers, one controlling template, one allen key, 18 screws, and 18 washers. Once you have checked your kit, unscrew the four screws from the upper shell using the allen key supplied and then keep the four screws. You will need them later when you put the shell back together. When the four screws are fully unscrewed, take out the upper shell. You can now access the rubber washers and see that they are worn out. Take the island key to unscrew and take off the 8 screws and the rubber washers from the first roller. Watch out that you don't mix the old screws with the ones from the new kit. Repeat this step with a second roller. First of all, take out the upper part of the rollers. Then, take out the rubber washers. Put in place the new rubber washers. It is important to change both of the rubber washers with the new ones supplied in the kit, even if just one of the rubber washers is worn out. Then, put back the upper part of the roller, as is it shown on the video. Now that everything is put in place, you must screw with the screws and washers supplied in the new kit. Start to loosely put screws in place. Take the template and place it on the roller. You may notice that the rubber washers and the template are not aligned. With the key supplied, tighten by half a turn the first screw and then repeat to the next screw, respecting the tightening order as it is shown on the video. Repeat this step as long as the rubber washers is not aligned with the template.
Now the rubber washer is perfectly in line with the template. Once you're done with this step, repeat it again on the second molar. The replacement of the rubber washers is done. You only have to put the upper shell in place with the four screws that you have kept, starting with the screws from the back of the shell. Once the tightening is done, you can use our beaker again.